if we were able to have complete vacuum we would talk about absolute zero pressure. Whatever you are in the planet, the weight of the air on top of your head will cause something known as atmospheric pressure, which is also known as barometric pressure. There is also pressure above the atmospheric, which is for example the one inside a pressurized reactor. If we measure this pressure relative to the atmospheric one, we will talk about gauge pressure and this one can be positive as it is shown now, or it can be negative, in which case is known as a vacuum, and it is expressed as a negative number. The units normally used are PSIG or bars. There can also be absolute pressure, which is the one measured relative to the absolute zero pressure, and the units used are normally PSIA or bar A. It can also be above the atmospheric pressure.